This is Christian Ackerman with Fast Coast Productions, and I'm not at Fast Coast Productions. I'm in my study at my house, and I'm going to give you a quick little tour. I love the view of my study. This is not really an office of work, but an office of creativity, of things I love. I mean, over here I got like comic books. Uh, things from my childhood, some things my friends have given me over the years. These I love. These two items here are from KB Toy Store. When it was open, I purchased those KB. They sell the KB Toy Store stickers. Yes, I am the guy who keeps everything packaged, but I do take certain things out of the package. So yeah, look at that. There's some stuff up. Rocketeer, original Lino. I got some A-Team toys and not A-Team toys. <laughs> Um, uh, short Circuit, um, Johnny Five, Millennium Falcon, this bank's awesome, it actually works. Special Edition DVD, double disc DVD, when the first Transformers came out. Yeah, C-3PO for Phantom Menace. Yes, that's actually in the box. Waterworld, Burger King hat, my movie posters. Actually, there's a lot around, they're kind of falling off them. Because I kind of have them temporarily up. An original poster of Arnold Schwarzenegger. I got a, a watch collection. And all my cons that I've done over the years. And got my original NES from when I was a kid. I got Rock a Doodle. Yes. I got a lot of cool. Oh, yes. The good movies, oh yes. Good film. Oh, this is my favorite one. Chuck E. Cheese, please. Uh, there's a mad ball up there. What else did I not show you? Oh yeah, my original toy Ghostbusters popper gun. That's uh, the Ghostbusters toy. I'd, my friend gave me this one after I helped him on the show, Tim Nidell. Um, I used to have this when I was a kid. I don't know what happened to it, but when he knew I used to have this toy and cherish this toy, this was my, like, my own Ghostbusters toy I had. It was this guy and the this thing? A little paper DeLorean, some Nerf glasses, some other crazy good movies. Yes, that's a Toys R Us exclusive. What else have we got up here? My projector. I love that. Cops. Wait. Oh, my favorite. Guardians of the Galaxy issue one. Um. There's my Jerry. Duck Duck Space Jam. He Man, Master of the Universe, Record, and Read Along Book. I used to have this Terminator Future War toy that you can change out the head. When I was a kid, I used to love playing with that thing. Um, with my, I would actually make, I'd cross universes and make Predator and him like team up or something like that. And there he is, man. There he is. The Ripper from Last Action Hero. Got some. Doc Brown, Marty McFly, got Predator down there, got some cool, I got the issue of when Superman died. A lot of these are from when I was a kid. Got Snake Plus, Man, yes. And then, you know, I got another Terminator toy back here, you can't even see it. Got some old trading cards and all good stuff. See over here, this wall, Star Trek um, record cover. Friend got me this. Got a sign thing. Pee Wee Herman. Here's a Disneyland ticket where I went to Disneyland for like three or four days at the park. All my movie posters. Board game for Ninja Turtles. Why I like this board game, this is why this is up here. You look closely at the artwork. It's actually the artwork of the original Turtles when they all had the same color bandanas when it was more of a graphic novel and they just kind of colored them appropriately. So they all look the same. They do have their different weapons and stuff, but it's pretty cool. And then Bebop and Rocksteady just do not look like how they did in the cartoon. I mean, maybe he, he looks a little closer. Or Nell looks a little closer. I mean, you got pretty much all the characters up there, which I love. Raiders of the Lost Ark poster, and this poster was originally the Revenge of the Jedi, but it's the fixed one, Return of the Jedi. So a lot of cool. Cool stuff. This is like my side. I can work here. I can look out towards the mountains, which you can't even see right now. It's snow and snow is coming like crazy right now in 
um, to the valley. See stuff on the desk here. Got a little Nerf gun that I like. It just reminds me of the blade. Um, that blade, um, blade runner gun. Got a little joust game. It actually turns on. You actually can play it. I can turn it on. There it goes. Play joust. And my BB-8. My little simple configuration computer. I have a little old Mac Mini 2014 model there that I just kind of do little things on. So there's my tour of my study. I like calling it a study because um, I have an office that's out in Hamilton, so I don't like it's, it's for the family, so they don't get confused where I'm at. Oh, I'll be in my study. I'm gonna go if I say I'm going to. Fa I normally say I'm going to Fastco's or my office. If I say office, then it means I'm going downtown to Fastco. So um, this is my study. So this place is where I can think, and then I have an open white wall with nothing on it. It's good for filming, but it also, I have my projector up there. And so I watch movies, all these movies here. And they're all out too. Um, just, I can't fit them all out because they go down below here too. So I put these shelves in and I watch films. I also have a little project back here. I almost forgot to show. It's like a mess right now. Oh yeah, there's my Trapper Keeper with all my baseball cards in it. I'll have to go through that sometime. But I'm making my own little miniature. Um, it has a Disneyland map on it. It's kind of like storage. Um, I'm making my own little uh, arcade unit there because I've made arcades in the past, like cabinets. So, hope you enjoyed that tour of my study here at my homestead. And I think it's always important to have a place or a room or somewhere you can go to get your creative juices flowing. And so, I like that I have my office at Fast Coast where I can actually take clients in when we're working on commercials and stuff like that, where it's actually a professional environment where people can sit down and we're not like distracted, but we're in that environment where we can just get things done. And it's mainly for work and then um, to get other you know projects and things flowing and stuff like that. Then I come up here to just get inspired, regenerated, and ready to go again. So today just got off work I've been up since 4:30. Uh, I didn't have to but I got up 4:30 because I had a meeting at 6 45 a.m. today at the school uh, talking about our classes and all that kind of stuff it was really awesome went really well both of my um, people that I invited to come and support and um, support me and all that kind of stuff both showed up it was really cool and they gave their two cents it was awesome then today we had a fun day in class it was crazy here's a little sneak peek That's what we did in class. Hopefully, I don't get in trouble because the kids were having a blast. It was awesome. Um, and boy, today was a great day. I just want to tell you guys about it, but then I'd just be talking a lot. This video was just about the tour. So, guys, thank you for joining me on my tour of my study. Um, and I just want to put it out there. Thank you to my wife for letting me have a study. She's awesome. She lets me have a place. Um, to put up all my silly nonsense stuff, the stuff that I wouldn't really decorate the house with, but she does let me decorate the house with old Hollywood stuff. So like the old Hollywood posters and things like that. So we, we do share that in common. But anyways, guys, thank you again for watching this video, the tour of my study. I'm Christian Ackerman with Fast Coast Productions. I hope to see you in the movies.